Hey there, friends. Thanks for checking in. Here's my Colt Python. Just a beautiful revolver. Many people consider the Python one of the finest revolvers ever made, and there's certainly no argument from me. This one's an all stainless steel with a six inch barrel. Incredible trigger action. Chambered in 357 and beautiful wood grips right there. Together, the package is unmatched, and many people love this, and, and I cherish this revolver. But for years, people have said, when is Colt going to bring back their snake revolvers? We, we want their snake revolvers back. They would sell thousands and thousands if they just brought back their snake guns. Well, a couple years ago, they brought back the Colt Cobra in 38 Special, and this year, they brought back the Colt King Cobra in 357 Magnum, and here is the newest one and the King Cobra line. This is the Colt King Cobra Target. It was released in late August of 2019, and here it is with wood grips and a four and a quarter inch barrel. Just an amazing 357 revolver that I am so looking forward to getting this to the range because I just know how it's going to perform. Now, when Colt first started producing these, okay, they started with a three inch barrel king cobra with a three inch barrel and rubber hoe grips then they went with the carry model with a two inch barrel with rubber hoe grips and now the target model with these wood grips these are all Alt altamont grips and i think they are beautiful you can see that it has some slight texturing there smooth wood grain throughout light texturing on the side panels and I'm very much impressed with the way that looks and feels. It does have the Colt medallion on both sides. We're used to that. Strategically placed. And you can also see it does have the Colt pony right there. It's a six shot 357 Magnum. All right. And the, the one thing that is common with Colt is that the cylinder does rotate clockwise. Opposed to so many others out there, like the Smiths, they go counterclockwise. Many of the others go counterclockwise. Colt rotates clockwise. But a four and a quarter inch barrel and an elevated fiber optic front sight and an adjustable rear sight. That's why they call it the target model. Now, Colt wants this to be a game changer in the competitive market, and maybe it will be. Diehard Colt fans are going to love the target model because of that you know the, the the longer barrel the adjustable grips i'm sorry the adjustable sights and the beautiful wood grips that give this a little more of a traditional look opposed to the rubber grips and that's the reason one of the reasons why i went with this model now we could see here it does have a full under lug all right that'll uh, prevent uh, some of that muzzle rise that the 357 offers I already showed a six shot all right got the ejector arm right there and there we have the forcing cone and over here we have our firing pin our timing hand right there and our bolt stop and over on this side take a look at the yoke and the crane just a just a nice package Colt put together here and I, I know Colt purists are going to enjoy this target model and and I know I'm going to enjoy it now the double action trigger pull I'm pretty impressed with I'm going to guess right around nine pounds maybe nine and a half pounds all right my trigger scale doesn't go up that high but it does measure that single action trigger pull right around three and a quarter pounds look at that you barely touch it it's a light trigger just like that on average, three and a quarter pounds is what I'm measuring. And and I think, you know, with that double action and with Colt wanting to get into the competition market with this revolver, that that trigger is going to be a selling point for Colt. Let's get it on the scale here. Now, the website is measuring or weighing this, I should say, at 36 ounces. But I am weighing it just a little lighter than that. Two pounds, two and three quarters ounces. If we go to just ounces, we're looking at 34 and three quarters ounces. So a little bit lighter than what the website says. That's not much though. And we'll add here six rounds of 158 grain target load, 357 Magnum, 38 and a quarter ounces. So with that type of weight, I think it's going to decrease 
that recoil that the 357 offers. It does also have, I forgot to mention this, a recessed crown barrel. If we look close in there, we can see that. And together, this stainless steel package is beautiful. Colt known for the cylinder release, pulling back on it just like that. All right. Very well timed. Very good looking revolver. And this is, in my opinion, the snake gun I've been waiting on. I think you guys are going to dig it. And I like that engraving right there too. It does have the cobra right in the middle of the words King Cobra. What a beauty. I'll get this to the range this weekend. Be on the lookout for that. I have high expectations with this one. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.